the way the, the, the daft uncle in an Irish movie or in a British movie gets. And she was like, oh, very unfortunate. Very unfortunate is happening. Like, so she just called it very unfortunate. She saw the writing on the wall. Very unfortunate is happening. Black coffee in bed, question mark? Now that might be a clue for a six letter word with a Q in the second position, and it might be squeeze. This is my favorite part about the New York Times crossword puzzle, that and cursing whoever writes it. But my friend Maria and I would talk about how much we hated Gene Maleska. May he rest in peace. Then when Will Shorts came along, I loved him because I had subscribed to Games Magazine. Do you know this thing from the 80s? It was fantastic. It was the best, best, best thing of my teenage life, and I would bring it to high school. As it turns out, that only prepared me to do puzzles that Will Shorts edited in my 20s and 30s, 40s. But I love the questions. Those are the ones that are easiest for me. Figuring out the trick, figuring out, you know, you know, number, let's say, uh, number eight across, and it will say, with 16 across, 25 across, and 42 across, the reason for seven down. And then you're like, okay, great. So like seven down might be uh, lunar landing. And then the other thing would be, you know, the reason for it or uh, quotation. You know, that's one small step for a man or, you know, what have you. Or it, it would be like speaker of so-and-so, so-and-so, and so-and-so across. And then the answer might be Armstrong. I love that. That's the easiest part for me. That and esoteric lakes, other bodies of water, you know, tree toads, the Latin word for nostrils, all of that kind of thing. Yeah, you learn that argo, but finding out the trick, I love it. So you think, how does this fit? How does this fit? How does this fit? I thought it was square root. And then you find out that blank R-O-O-T is square root. And then you think, oh, so the reason I couldn't get this other one is that it's square meal. And then you realize that in an observable pattern, there are going to be blank squares. I haven't done the puzzle in a really long time, but maybe the puzzle is what I'm looking for because things right now feel really puzzling to me and it might be fun to have some, pardon the pun, cross words for the person who's currently editing the New York Times crossword puzzle. Thank you.